Hurricane season is upon us. With Hurricane Hillary being the latest West Coast hurricane since Hurricane Nora in 1997, and Hurricane Adalia about to hit the West Coast of Florida, these are the latest high-profile storms we have heard about in 2023. As hurricane season ramps up and the storm frequency begins increasing, how does a flight school like Epic Flight Academy handle an approaching hurricane like Adalia? Hurricane season takes place between August and October. These massive storms tend to form in the Atlantic Ocean, the Caribbean Sea, and the Gulf of Mexico. Warm oceans contribute to the formation of much stronger storms, and wouldn't you know it, Florida's oceans are usually quite warm during the summer, especially this year. Typically, Florida has a good track record of having afternoon rain or thunder showers during the summer months. Epic expects this, which leads to many of our students usually flying in the morning or early afternoon. But as hurricanes are approaching, what are the steps a flight school takes before, during, and after a hurricane? My name is Ray Altman, and I am the CFI course leader at Epic Flight Academy. So there's a, a good amount of preparation that is involved preparing for a hurricane. It involves moving our aircraft to a safer area, whether that being in hangars or um, outside of the danger zone of the hurricane. Um, we also need to prepare our facilities and our students and staff for the hurricane that's coming. As a hurricane starts to pose a threat to our area, we usually give about three to five days notice of preparation and start making a plan of action. Some of the preparations we must do before a hurricane comes is determine what we're doing with our aircraft, whether it's putting them in hangars locally or flying them out to a different airport, so finding an area for them to go. Uh, we also prepare the facilities for um, rain and wind and flooding, so we'll um, sandbag the buildings, make sure that everything is you know, protected inside. Um, anything we have outside goes inside to prevent any um, foreign objects or debris flying around on the ramp. The day after the hurricane, we will have staff members on site to assess the situation and begin preparing for opening. So some days we'll be ready to go 24 hours after a hurricane. Um, other times it might take a little more time to get ready. Um, students and staff that may have evacuated, we also understand it takes a few days for them to return. Uh, but uh, normally operations are back to normal around two to three days after a hurricane. Epic Flight Academy's priority has always been safety for our students and staff, as well as our aircraft and facilities. Epic has been through many powerful storms before and will continue to promote safety to ensure our operations can resume as quickly as possible after the hurricane has passed. Stay safe.